In my previous video, I showed you how to add text to your videos in Adobe Premiere Pro and at the end of that video, I promised you to show how to add and create cinematic titles such as this one. So here I am to show you just that. This is a very simple process and I'll walk you through it step by step. These cinematic titles are great if you use them correctly. These can be added to your short films, your montages or that dream editing project you have always wanted to work on. But before we begin, please consider subscribing to our channel and hitting that bell icon as well so that you do not miss out on any of our latest videos. So hello everyone, this is Robin here from Gadgets360 and without any further delay, let's jump into Premiere Pro and sort this thing out. Firstly, we'll start by importing a black video into the timeline. To do so, click on new item and then black video. Now drag it onto the timeline and you can choose the duration according to your needs. Now click on the type tool and type out your text as I showed you in our previous video. Once that's done, make sure the text layer's duration matches that of the black video. Select the entire text by using the shortcut buttons Ctrl plus A on Windows and Command plus A on your Mac. Now head over to the effect controls and choose the font you like. For this video, I'll go with Leto Bold. Set the size of your title according to your frame and now increase the tracking so as to create more space between each letter. Go over to the Essential Graphics tab here and then go to Edit. Now under Align and Transform, center the text horizontally and vertically. This will make the entire text fit perfectly in the middle of the frame. Now go back to Effect Controls and open the Opacity settings while making sure the text layer is still selected. Go to the first frame on the timeline and now lower down the opacity to 0. This will create a keyframe. Go to the 2 second time frame and increase the opacity back to 100. Now move the marker to 4 second mark and create another keyframe. This time do not change any values. Now move to the 6 second mark and drop the opacity back to 0. This creates a fading effect on the text. To make it even smoother, select all the keyframes and right click any one of them and now select Auto Bezier. Go to the first frame on the timeline as we did before and now click the scale properties option and click the stopwatch to create a keyframe. Go to the last frame of your text and increase the scale by 10 or 15. And as you can see the text seems to be coming towards the screen. To smoothen it out right click on the last keyframe in the scale tab and choose ease in. The final step includes adding a Gaussian blur to the text. To do so, head over to the effects and drag it onto the text layer. Now go to the first frame of your video and create a keyframe under Gaussian blur by clicking the stopwatch. Set the value to 50 and move 2 seconds ahead. Now change the value to 0. Go ahead 2 seconds and add another keyframe without changing any values. And lastly, create another keyframe 2 seconds ahead of the previous one and now change the value to 50 once again. And as you can see, this is your result. So that was a simple yet very appealing way to add titles to your videos. So what did you guys think about this tutorial? Let me know down below in the comment section. And as always, for all things tech, log on to Gadgets360.com.